to Dr. Stephen Hawking. We all have a sense of Stephen Hawking, the icon. When I read this script, it was completely astounding to read that he had been entirely healthy when he was younger. Right. Right. This story focuses on Jane and Stephen meeting at a very young age. Hello. Hello. Science. Arts. I'm inviting Jane to be my partner to the May Ball. Really? Wow. Very impressive. They fell instantly in love with each other. It was a meeting of minds, really. Stephen, at that time, was like, carefree, witty. There was an immediate attraction, and I think they challenged each other as well. I study the marriage of space and time. One never knows from where the next great leap forward is going to come. What if I reverse time to see what happened at the beginning of time itself? Wind back the clock. The heart of it really is this emotional story. Wind back the clock. The story of a relationship that's founded on love that is set in the most unusual circumstances. It's called motor neuron disease. Life expectancy is two years. Jane has this impossible choice to make. Does she stay with Stephen when he's diagnosed with this terminal illness, or does she escape? I want us to be together for as long as we've got. You don't know what's coming. The journey we take is Stephen's early promise in the shadow of this illness. This will not be a fight, Jane. This is going to be a very heavy defeat. It's so important to me to show the depth of giving that Jane had to have to keep helping Stephen. I know what you all think, that I don't look like a terribly strong person. But I love him. And he loves me. My name is Stephen Hawking. It's American. Is that a problem? Their capacity to survive against all odds was quite an amazing thing. I hope that this film will surprise people. About his character, about his family, about this extraordinary woman that was the fuel behind a lot of his success. All these things that make someone live a full life. And my God, has he lived a full life and continues to.